guys, good morning. If you're new here, welcome. My name's Allison and I'm a grad student here in Tokyo. And as you saw last vlog, I finally made it back to Japan. Thank God. It was a long, traumatic journey to get here, believe me. But I'm back and I can't wait to get started again with my usual vlogs around Tokyo. I haven't actually really been out yet. I've been free from quarantine for about five days now, but I have a lot of schoolwork to do, so I still have another term paper due next week, which I haven't started, but I'm gonna just take today off and have fun, and then I'll get back to work tomorrow. So today we're gonna go to Asakusa, and I'm gonna meet up with my friend later in the day, but first I think I'm gonna go to karaoke, because I haven't been in two or three months maybe, which is crazy, because if you watch my vlogs, I love going to karaoke alone. It's like my favorite thing. So I'm really sad I haven't been. It's already actually 12.30, so I guess it's not morning. Um, yeah, waking up early didn't last long. This is just my natural pace, I guess. But yeah, so I'm gonna go to karaoke and then I'm gonna meet up with my friend. We're gonna go eat and walk around. Now that there's no tourists, the Saksa area is like really nice <laughs> to walk around. Like there's Japanese tourists, but you know. So I'm excited. And I am actually filming this on my new camera right now. So I'm sorry if the settings are strange. I haven't had time to really go through it and fix it. I am ordering a microphone. So hopefully my next vlog. Just kidding, it's happening today. Haha. <laughs> the audio will be better. I got this camera when I was in America. And then I also got a new iPhone. That's very exciting because I had been filming on my iPhone 8 for a lot of things. So now I have the new one. Yeah, I'm gonna bring both the cameras today and just see what happens. But yeah, let's get going. I'm running late, of course, and I'll talk to you guys later. Okay, and this is today's outfit. Oh, the mirror's dirty, sorry. I got this bag. This is H&M, Ekosopo, American Eagle. And then this jacket is from Ekosopo. I just got it, it's new. I love this sleeve thing. All right, so let's go catch the bus. <laughs> Kan and Asakusa. I quite like this one because I think the price is reasonable, especially for the area. And if you're a student, this only cost me two hours. All you can drink soft drinks for, I think he said it was like 500 yen. It was under 600 yen, under $6, which I think is pretty good. I don't like this place though, because like you have to order it like where the person brings you the drink. So yeah, this is the setup. Got my drink already. And there is a view outside through these dirty curtain things, but it's really hot. See, there's stuff outside. Let's get singing. Oh my god. Evanescence. Send. Oh my god. This is just like 2009 anime MV day.
Shinjuku. So I had an unexpectedly long day out, which is good because I haven't been out in the city, you know, in like two months almost. We are kind of still in like a little baby state of emergency, I guess. But whatever, I think we're going to be out of it soon, I hope, by the end of February. But yeah, I had a nice day out and I made a very nice, biggish purchase. I got a microphone, <laughs> finally. I'm very excited because I've never had a microphone on my camera before. So now from the next time I film, my audio will hopefully be a lot better than it is now. So look forward to that. I'm investing in the channel. I'm investing in my hobby. So yeah, I think I'm gonna end it here tonight and I'll see you guys again in a few days. Good afternoon, guys. It is already after one and I did not wake up until noon. Just being real with you. Uh, but today I'm gonna go to Shibuya to go back to the Cardcaptor Soccer Cafe, the same one I went to like a month and a half ago, two months ago. Today is actually the last day they're doing it. So me and my friend are just gonna go. And before that, I think I'm just gonna walk around Shibuya. So yeah, that's the plan for today. The weather isn't the best. It's a little cloudy and cold out. Look, here's my new microphone. <laughs> it's kind of huge, but you know. And this is the outfit. It's all Ekosopo. But I do want to draw attention to the tights because they look see-through but actually they're lined with like skin colored fleece on the inside so it looks like i'm just wearing like thin tights but actually they're super thick and i'm worried about getting them off to go to the bathroom <laughs> those are just from three coins i've never worn these super thick ones before these are the thickest i also have like a medium thickness one these ones are kind of tight <laughs> we'll see I am excited to go to Shibuya, but it's a Sunday, so I'm worried how crowded it's going to be. Usually I don't like to do that much stuff on the weekend because, you know, I work on Saturdays. I worked yesterday for the first time, seven classes for the first time in like two months almost. So that's why I slept in so much today, I think, because I was so exhausted. But the kids are so cute. So, okay. Anyway, <laughs> let's get going.
Hey guys, I just got back from Shibuya. You know, I was kind of surprised by how it really wasn't that crowded in Shibuya or any of the stores we went to. I guess because of, you know, uh, the pandemic spreading here, but it was nice for me. I already got it, so. But yeah, I had a nice time. I love character cafes, even if they're kind of overpriced. You know, it's just fun to go every now and then. And I think I've mentioned this before, but if you visit Tokyo, if the borders ever open up again, you have to go to the Parko Mall in Shibuya. It's new. Well, newish. They have just so many good stores in there. Something for everyone, like fashion, anime, games, a lot of really good stuff. Even like, they have like a tourist floor, I think, kind of, of like Japanese stuff. I don't know. It's really nice though. So yeah, we just went with my friend and he gave me the Mr. Donuts Pokemon Fukubukuro that he so kindly kept for me since I couldn't meet up with him until now. You know, originally he was only going to hold on to it for like a week or two, but then uh, I got stuck in America. <laughs> so I'm going to be opening that up in another video. So look out for that if you want to see it. It's going to come out next. And yeah, I think for the rest of the night, I'm just going to, I guess, just play Pokemon. I started it last night, finally, but I started playing it in Japanese, but, you know, I think it's just too, it's too different than normal Pokemon. I think I need to switch it to English because my head kind of hurts after playing it for like an hour just from like looking up words and trying to read the rules for once because usually, you know, in Pokemon, I just skip through all that stuff, but now I need to pay attention because <laughs> normally Pokemon's a great game to play if you're learning Japanese. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I'm so happy to be back here and able to film vlogs and stuff. Let me know if there's anything you guys want to see in the future. I feel like it's been a while since I really was able to create like videos. Does that make sense? I don't know. <laughs> well, thank you guys so much. Make sure you like the video, please. It helps me so much and leave a comment down below and subscribe if you're not already for more content about my life here in Tokyo. Not leaving anytime soon. Already got trapped out of the country once. No more. All right, I'll see you guys back here again next week. Bye.